Decades have passed since I first delved into the arcane arts. Since I dared to embrace the power that flows not only within me, but within everyone. It feels like an eternity. Yet the memories of my journey remain vivid, etched upon the tapestry of my existence. I first discovered the path of magic and witchcraft. I was filled with an unspeakable amount of trepidation and uncertainty. Society branded it an enigma, evil. It was a forbidden art. Little did they know that magic itself is our birthright. A connection to both realms and realities beyond the average normal mortal comprehension. Over the years, I have traversed the astral plane, harnessed the raw energy of arcane forces, and communed with beings both benevolent and malevolent. I have honed my craft, learned to command the elements, or to at least ask them nicely. Practicing the occult, magic, witchcraft is not about wielding power for personal gain. Although that is a side benefit, it's not about indulging in selfish desire because we all know what happens when we do that. It is about seeking harmony within the chaos that is our reality. Understanding the unseen forces that shape our world and our perception of this world. It is about being a guardian of balance to sound like a Jedi and to restore equilibrium or bring balance to the force. Through my art and magic, I have mended the broken, shielded the vulnerable, and offered guidance to those lost in the labyrinth of existence. I have stood as a beacon of hope in the darkest of times for many people, illuminating the path of those who seek my counsel. And yes, surprisingly, they do. <laughs> but being a magician or a witch is not about it without its trials. The path I have chosen demands an unwavering discipline, constant exploration, and a profound awareness of the consequences of all the magic that we unleash, not only as individuals, but as a community. Yet I would never trade this life for anything. Me, it is a gift, a responsibility that I bear with utmost honor. It has sculpted me into the man I am today, wise, compassionate, attuned to the currents of the universe. As I look back and gaze softly upon the journey that is the tapestry of my life, I am filled with utmost gratitude for the ancient wisdom bestowed upon me, for the many mentors who have guided me, and for the mystical forces that have intertwined with my soul. And for another 20 years, I shall continue to tread this path, the path less traveled. I will embracing the magician within me. Embracing that deep-rooted, ancient, primal magic that we all have. And I will continue to use that which is given to me by the universe and the creative principle in itself to restore harmony where chaos reigns, to protect those in need, and to illuminate the hidden truths that lay dormant. For we are not merely magicians, wizards, witches, and sorcerers. We are guardians of the arcane, weavers of destinies, and the vessels of boundless potential. And with each passing day, we grow stronger, wiser, and more attuned to the symphony of magic that is our world. Live magically and stay mythical, my friends.